my fellow Americans, in this poignant hour, I ask you to join with me in prayer. Almighty God, our sons, pride of our nation, this day have set upon a mighty endeavor, a struggle to preserve our republic, our religion, and our civilization, and to set free a suffering humanity. Lead them straight and true. Give strength to their arms, stoutness to their hearts, steadfastness in their faith. They will need thy blessings. Their road will be long and hard. For the enemy is strong. He may hurl back our forces, but we shall return again and again. The darkness will be rent by noise and flame. Men's souls will be shaken with the violences of war. Some will never return. Embrace these, Father, and receive them, thy heroic servants, into thy kingdom as we rise to each new day and again when each day is spent. Let words of prayer be on our lips. Give us faith. Give us faith in thee, faith in our sons, faith in each other, faith in our united crusade that will spell a sure peace, a peace invulnerable to the schemings of unworthy men, and a peace that will let all men live in freedom reaping the just rewards of their honest toil. Thy will be done, almighty God. Amen. We're up here cut off from the whole thing by a layer of clouds. All I can see are a few ships shooting like mad at something. But the mist is closing in again. Above the English Channel, Bert Stiles strains to survey the scenes on the beaches below. There's not a speck of flak. I guess all the flak guns are leveled, waiting for our guys on the ground. and airmen of the Allied Expeditionary Force. You are about to embark upon the Great Crusade toward which we have striven these many months. The eyes of the world are upon you. The hopes and prayers of liberty-loving people everywhere march with you. the destruction of the German war machine, the elimination of Nazi tyranny over the oppressed peoples of Europe, and security for ourselves in a free world. 
Your task will not be an easy one. Your enemy is well trained, well equipped and battle hardened. He will fight savagely. together to victory. I have full confidence in your courage, devotion to duty, and skill in battle. We will accept nothing less than full victory. 